Mustafa Salomon from Microsoft is now leading the Microsoft super intelligence team to try and make a play for their own version of AGI, ASI, um, independent of OpenAI. And this happened at the same time that OpenAI has uh, given a big recommendation to everyone to be ready. We're about to get big movements in 2026 and 2028 with new scientific discoveries being achieved by AI autonomously, um, which will allow for faster and faster intelligence runaways um, until we get this super intelligence. We've also got Meta, with a, who's done a big pivot away from sort of usable products um, in the AI space, more towards super intelligence. This seems to be a, a big movement by the big players all at once. What do you think of this? Yeah, look, it's funny, you know, because I, I'm, a, I'm a little bit cynical on one sense because AGI and super intelligence, sort of these nebulous terms, which don't have any really clear definition. And I know that uh, there are some people that are, uh, have said that we'll have self-driving cars five years ago and still we, here we are. So you can put out all these big terms and these big predictions about what's going to happen. Um, I think we are going to get there and what it looks like. I mean, if you had uh, looked at a Today LLM, which we, we're in November of 2025, you would say it's AGI, yet we're not at AGI yet. So it's interesting that these terms and these teams are starting to really trying to put this news out that we are going to have something by 2026 and 2028 and we're going to have discoveries and all that sort of stuff. I just don't know. I wonder if the marketing team has a little bit to do with this. Well, I think it is interesting. There's a, there's a lot of money and talent going into this play, so I don't think it's purely marketing. Um, what The difference that I see is, uh, I think Ilya Suskova said it best when he started up his own company called Safe Superintelligence, that they're doing a straight shot to superintelligence. All the other companies, OpenAI and everyone, mm. is very interested in productizing the level of intelligence that they have and then incrementally improving it and productizing that. But that's a big distraction. So now these core parts of these companies are just trying for that straight shot. They've got their super intelligence teams who are not distracted by anything but. So I think we're in very interesting times. Need help with AI solutions? Click on the channel link and follow the link tree.